we are at two thirds of the entire turnout we saw in the 2020 election already. Um, there is a possibility it could be a ghost town on election day. 45% of the 7.2 million registered voters in Georgia have already voted since early voting began. More Georgians turned out to vote on the first day of early voting than any previous day in a general election in the state's history. The high voter turnout is a major accomplishment for the state and could signal greater excitement among voters for both Trump and Vice President Kamala Harris. Sterling warned that the state anticipates lawsuits regardless of who wins the election next week. We don't know who's going to win. And who wins will decide who sues us, um, essentially, at the end of the day. So if Vice President Harris wins, we expect uh, Trump officials to sue us. If, if President Trump wins, we expect Harris officials to sue us. The Secretary of State's office has spoken with Governor Brian Kemp about lining up special assistant attorney generals for any forthcoming legal action from either campaign.